All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more Daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, we got the next patch. Patch, they saying, you know, it's update, uh, they were saying it's update four. Uh, they saying it's three, you know, on the thing, bro. Update three, patch four, update three. I don't know what it is, man, but y'all see it playing this day right here, bro. It says on the site, it's update three. But Ronnie called it patch four. I don't know, man. It is what it is. We're going to get into all that and more right after this. So if you don't do nothing else, make sure you like the video because it makes it easier for us to blow up. Like Dub CP, blow up! And get, the, get in the YouTube algorithm, man. And uh, we just want to be at 100K by the end of the day. <laughs> you know that's not going to happen. But you know it is what it is, man. Let's just get right into the video. Lino! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything. Just don't be average. Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me sad. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that head. Alright, so just right off the bat, man, I'm just going to read this joint and we just going to go down NBA 2K21 tw uh, Next Gen update, uh, the courtside report, bro. And uh, like I said, bro, a lot of people out there saying they're having a lot of fun with the game. A lot of people say they're not, you know, they're having fun in the park and all of that stuff. Like I said, I contend that if you're playing in the wreck, you're probably having the most fun. Uh, with this game because you got people to help you stop people and stuff like that you can run defensive schemes and all that but uh if you're playing in the park you're probably just sitting in the corner on either side where your point guard is iso on the guy and as soon as they bite you got to hit your shot it's uh it makes for like very repetitive gameplay like i said it's almost like stage 24 7. you see very few insides you see all of you see very very little of that and you really see it when the events come up i'm not even gonna lie to you but you see that gas every time you see me play the game baby Gas. Anyway, um, it makes it it makes it tough. It makes it uh, repetitive. But just stay. I, all I'm saying is the gameplay gonna be repetitive because everybody that got the game right now is a sweat. The dude that I was talking about this morning to say Zay said he lost 12 players and he spent $500 on 12 players. 2K, y'all got to get this man his players back. I don't see nothing in these patch notes talking about we gonna recover people. Play 12 players, 500 bucks, and he said he spent $700 on the system so he could get it because you know somebody had to uh, get up on the ground play boy oh damn he had to spend he had to spend some money 700 on the system because he wanted to get it early now you think he came out here with that to not sweat you think people spending that type of money to not sweat so everybody that's playing the game right now is a sweat because they paid money to get their character to 99 already and they paid money more money for the system so everybody's sweating that's why you're seeing such sweaty gameplay all the time Rest assured, when the randoms get the game, you're going to see a lot more inside guys. It's going to be a lot less ISO, a lot more random type gameplay, and, and it's not going to be like that uh, every time. But when you go in these doggone events, I'm talking about people are sweating. And these events are really killing people's boxes, making people's stuff shut down, and making people lose their players and stuff like that. Hopefully, all of that's addressed in here. But anyway, bro. Let's just get right into it. With the holiday season just around the corner, uh, a new update for NBA 2K21 uh, has arrived just in time. Visual concepts, blah, 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 yakety smackety. General, um, let me see. General, court floor updates have been made. So the Philadelphia 76ers court, uh, the, the primary and the city court. The city court, okay. Uh, Utah Jazz primary and the city court. Oh, the city as like that, okay. Brooklyn, Nets, the city court. Uh, Denver's Denver Nuggets uh, statement court and uh, Denver Nuggets city court. Then you got the uniform updates that, that have been uh, for the following teams: Philadelphia 76 and Chicago Bulls, New York Knickerbockers, uh, Cleveland Cavaliers, the New Orleans Pelicans, Los Angeles Clippers. The Clippers uh, updated the sponsors logo and stuff like that. I guess uh, Boston Celtics, Brooklyn Nets, um, the Atlanta Rags. <laughs> Oh, I can get up off the floor. Gavin, get up. Uh, you know, the uh, the New York, the <laughs> Denver Nuggets, the Los Angeles Lakers, and the uh, the Washington uh, Wizards, man. I ain't gonna lie. Like I said, you're gonna see a lot more random gameplay as it goes. The following players receive the likenesses update. So you, you, we all know that they said that every time they update the game, one of the major focuses is we're gonna update the likenesses. Um, my guy Dimework said he, he scanned his face in and it ain't as, 
ain't like he wanted to. I would really like to know how they're scanning these guys in because we need that technology, that technological advances allowing them to scan people in. But you know, uh, it is what it is. That's that's the wrong uh, button that I just <laughs> hit there. But as I said, the following players, Paul George, DeMar DeRozan, Bradley Beal, Kimball Walker, Draymond Green, my guy, um, my favorite player in the league, uh, Rudy Gobert, uh, Bill, uh, ben Simmons, Hassan Whiteside, Whiteside, uh, let's see, uh, Robin Lopez, Steven Adams, Isaac Okoro, Kelly Oubre, I don't know what the Hawks was thinking on that, Cassius Stanley, uh, Richard, and, and just a whole bunch of other people, man, it's a gang of people, it's like, like a, a ton of them, anyway, the uh, primary logo for the Toronto Raptors has been updated to reflect the, the latest design, uh, corrected a lighting issue in the historical Amway uh, Center, addressed an issue with shorts displaying incorrectly in certain situations, and resolved a rare, uh, a, what is it, a rare hang, I guess, you know, Hold on one second. I got to get this right, right, right quick. Hold on one second. Uh, no, we need three and three more time. Sorry about that, guys. It's a, sometimes, you know, stuff just go go wrong with this thing. Uh, but anyway, uh, let me see. Resolve the rare hang when important to face scan with the... Okay, so they did fix the app. Okay, good. So now we can do it. Because like I said, I was trying to do the joint, and it ain't trying to let me do it. But I am able to fight that gas, boy. Strays up, splash down. Yes! That's how I do it out there, man. Y'all make sure y'all come by the stream every day. I stream every day on here and on Twitch, man. And all we do is gas! That's all we do, man. Anyway, gameplay. Tighten up a charge charge and block collisions to prevent unwanted sliding. Thank you. I have not noticed it, but, uh, you know, uh, tighten, they tightened up the event unwanted. Can we fix the thing where, like, you know how you try to stand still in a spot so your point guard can begin the offense and you're a big center and you're trying to do it and it just makes you do this and this and this and then do this if you're a center y'all know what i'm talking about it's like brute be like jay stand the hell still i'm like brute i'm giving it all i can captain i can't stand still i'm doing everything i just can't do it captain i don't have the power that's what you're telling your your guard i'm trying to stand still bro it's making me stand out of bounds inbounds i'm running to the three-point line all i want to do is stand still and i'm holding l2 and it's, it's not working but anyway so they say they tighten it up cbu defenders will now properly recognize the direction of a screen uh after even after it's been flipped <laughs> do we believe that nope we just seen CPU get get destroyed all day. Smaller green release windows on heavily contested shots. Uh, I would say I've noticed that, but uh, I, I really haven't. Um, these heavily contested shots, they're still going in, but the problem is, is that you got on blinders, so you're not getting a contest, but it is what it is. Uh, fixed an issue with the double team that was uh, being exploited, used as an exploit. Double team being used as an exploit, the only thing I knew about that was you could put on you could put on Trapper and uh, double team people and stuff like that. But uh, I remember back in the day, you could just double team and it would always force a jump ball. Maybe there was some, uh, some type of my career thing. Adjusted breakout time uh, of in-game emotes to prevent unrealistic movement. Okay, that's cool. It's like, I guess that's when you try to get out of the uh, in-game emote and you jump up like that. Like you, you fall down, you land down, and then he just kicks up like that. I guess that's what they're talking about, bro. I don't know. Um, let me see. Corrected an issue with... with play graphics where the line for the pass would begin at my player where the line for the pass would begin at my player even if it didn't if you even if you didn't have the ball i guess man uh resolved an issue with certain settings sometimes getting reset when entering and exit the menu uh when in a game uh i really haven't noticed that bro the one that i really noticed was when people would get kicked out of the game and then they come back in and and and, and uh, your shot meters on stuff like that. I know notice that I really haven't noticed what they're talking about. You are now able to change the tempo and rebound settings. Um, you toggle the ace mat when you toggle the ace manager on and off. Okay, the players will no longer be able to move unrealistically while defending inbound passes uh, during garage hoop games. I guess I never saw that before. The city is being the city is being decked out for the holidays. We know the snow's coming tomorrow. I told y'all that I said that earlier that the, that, that, that was the main part thing I, I think was the update. Uh, continued optimization, optimize and refine uh, and refine continued optimization and refinements to uh, to performance in the city. That's cool. Various improvements and enhancements to the buildings, objects, and um and all of that stuff. Right, y'all boy. Hold on, man. this dude tough, bro. Like I'm, I'll be trying to tell y'all, man. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Take that man to the room. 
Let's take them all the way to the rim, man. That's what we do around here. Anyway, um, continued optimization, various improvements and enhancements to buildings. Further, imp for, for further improvements have been made to um, to invites and joining. Yeah, so we know that they fixed the invites. You land by people when you invite them. Streamline the process of entering the store when you are when you have a ball or a vehicle equipped. I guess uh, the try on feature should now work properly. All uh, right, in the standalone stores, that's cool. Rep multiplier will now correctly appear in the post game. I guess, man, because what it was doing was it was like you'd be trying to multiply your rep, but you would get half get the rep one game, and then the next game you would get all of it and then some. So it was just crazy, bro. I, I don't know, man, what they be doing with this joint. Um, corrected an issue where the VC balance would not update immediately upon earning various cities events. That's true because you would go out and come back and have way more VC. Continued enhancements to Pumania Mobile, Kia Challenge, and the Whack Yo. For real though, y'all need to do that. You gotta fix the event center, bro, because I hope it's fixed. I really do. But we we are literally afraid to play events because when we play these events, we're getting kicked out and you come back and it's saying player corrupted. And if you don't know how to negotiate the player corrupted thing, right? Because you don't watch these videos, then you're gonna be in some trouble and you're gonna lose your player like my boy Zadia. And that's unacceptable. Like y'all need to give these guys their players back plus VC for, uh, for pain and suffering and time lost on the game and however much rep they were earning daily, y'all need to append that to the player, man. Y'all need to do something like that, bro, because this is, this is unacceptable that people go out of their way to buy this game early and then their reward for trying to play these games and play to get double rep and all of that stuff, your reward for doing that is what? Your player might get deleted? I'm not even going into the event center until this thing is confirmed, fixed, because every time we go in there, Brute lags out, Gambit lags out, all that. We think it's tied to the resolution. If you're playing it higher than 1080 and 120, then you might have some problems. We, we've been playing, I, I play in uh, 1080, 120. I really rarely have issues, but they do. But they're on the X and I'm on the S. So who knows? But we think it's tied to that. But anyway, uh, somebody can confirm that or deny it or whatever. I don't know. But people can't be losing their players because of this stuff, man, because y'all didn't pr program something properly and then they're not even being properly compensated. Like, players just gone breezy missing the player. Uh, Nino missing players. Like, it's, 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 it's insane, but I'm, I'm not risking it. Y'all let me know if it's working. Anyway, fix an issue in the post-game recap uh, where overall rating was not current, was not correctly showing up uh, the tenth of the points. It would appear stuck at 99. Yes, uh, that's not been fixed, though. I guess, like I said, they must need to activate it because... The game that I played this morning, y'all saw it still said that we'll we'll look at that at the end of this at the end of this video, but we're gonna see, man. Address the uh the address user reported issued at the garage hoop games um and related flow. Um added collision to baskets in the warehouse challenges, warehouse challenges games, I guess, man. Uh resolved an issue where the timer counter would sometimes not track until a uh, track during workouts. Yeah, okay, we needed that. That needed to be you. You wouldn't know. Uh, it was like a video that All City put out. You wouldn't know how many reps you done and how many you had left. And then, like it was, it was mainly on the uh, the squat, the uh, the thigh press and stuff like that. You wouldn't know. So that's the correcting small visual issues uh, when using the subway. Uh, you are no longer able to enter and purchase items at the store for affiliations you don't belong to. You never should have been able to do that in the first place. I don't know who didn't test that out, but whatever. Uh, Pro Pro Am and Rec. Uh, new holiday uniform has been added for the for, for, that, all this must go go into 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 development on tomorrow because none of that happened from what y'all saw today. Um, resolved user reported issues with private matchmaking with the pro and gas fire that gas boy trades up splash down. I uh, improved the ability of CPU players uh, used as fill-ins. Uh, they said they improved them, but they really hadn't addressed an issue with with uh, invisible collision under the hoop uh, in pro am games. I guess uh, added tracking issue, added tracking issue, oh, look, address tracking issues with stats during games uh, in the wreck. We still sitting out there. Woo! Yes, we still we still sitting out there with F's after the game. Though I don't know if they fixed that. Uh, resolve the hang that could occur in the pro am. Uh, when editing the uniform, uh, we'll edit the uniform of other players and stuff like that. That's cool. My career continued improvements with the arena and personnel post game, particularly related to okay, your my player body type will now properly be kept individually per save. Swante put out a video about that where if you had, um, you know, you made a different my player, then the body type would change. You had to go make a new one and, and make it uh, do do what it do. Uh, you can now you can now skip through the animation 
in in my player walking back to the bench after the okay that's cool reserve resolved a rare are we just gonna skip over here and just read the rest of resolved a rare issue uh where newly applied tattoos uh would appear would disappear when changing your my player's appearance fixed a rare hang uh, that could occur in the jump shot uh, menu when customizing your shot. Fix an issue where your difficult where your, where your difficulty would be reset after participating in training sessions. Okay, addressed a logic error uh, in the in the long shadow when determining if your performance was good or bad uh, in the combine and 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 private NBA team workout. Corrected an issue. Um, uh, corrected a situation in the dunk contest. People do the dunk contest where the round recap overlay could stay on the screen for too long, obscuring the following dunk. Okay, that's cool. Uh, my NBA uh, uploaded player DNA uh, start from the offseason will now include the rookies. Addresses a hang, address the hang where some of the users are reported when attempting to start a new my NBA while uh, using the, uh, the address the hang. Bro, all this uh, edited tattoos, fixed progression, uh, resolve various stability issues, uh, con contracts, uh, for release players will no longer appear in the salary cap. That's cool. Players will now uh, continue to age after their age, after their age has been edited. Okay, that's cool. Various improvements uh, have been related to uh, you no longer able to edit players in ranked my league and uh, information uh, improved G League player generation to allow for more realistic prospects. And then uh, my NBA and the W. My WNBA, my wife actually plays in my WNBA, so I can't even get mad at it. Players will now be wearing the the uh, expected correct clothing uh, during the W online games. Does anybody play the W? Let me put a W down in the comment section if you play the W. The camera review will now always keep both players uh, in the ball and the screen. Added added baseline media to the to the WNBA arenas. Okay, fix the rare hang that could occur during the lottery in the WNBA. Addressed an issue with the WNBA where the, where the league MVP would also uh, be shown rookie of the year and blah, blah, blah. My team added online versus uh, the difficulty, blah, blah, blah. Look, man, the camera will now be positioned properly and uh, yeah, and a number of under the hood. Yeah, okay, so many more things. Look, bro, um, like I said, I don't know whether or not this thing, whether they're gonna, I don't know how they're gonna do it. I don't know what they're gonna fix. I don't know if it's even started yet and they gotta implement it later. I'm trying to find a video um, that I played, where I played this morning and uh, and see if it, there we go. Okay, so I found a video from this morning. Uh, no, I found a video from this morning, right? And we're going to see whether or not it's going to properly add up my stuff like because it said okay but we don't want that let's back it up back it up back it up all right so we want to win a circle is it before this let's see hey so it did work okay hold on hold on boom so it says your current overall weight 99 uh your new overall rating and i didn't take it out of the way so we can't damn see it but we're gonna see in a second. Yeah, your new overall rating is 99.9. .9. So some of this stuff has been has been put into effect. So I can't I can't just be like a lot of it is gonna be pushed in um into effect because a lot of it has been put into effect, but maybe it's just the visual stuff that's been put into effect. I haven't noticed any real gameplay changes like they say they have, but hey, it is what it is, man. We're gonna see. I know I ran off on a tangent and y'all probably didn't care about half of this stuff, but you know it is what it is. I gotta do the whole thing. Uh, they say it's better. We're going to see if it's better. But the real things we need, we need people to stop losing their players first and foremost. And these people need to be compensated if they lose their player. Number two, let's fix the event center so they don't they don't be losing their players and stuff like that. And fix the game from crashing for goodness sake. Like figure out what resolutions and what ray tracing and all that stuff you need and fix it, bro. These people, it's hard enough. These are hardworking people that want to support the game, but they can't because... The game is just it's, it's deleting their players. Nobody want to ground another player. Like I said, they should get it back with interest. And last but not least, like I said, bro, let's just get this thing fixed. Uh, let's get better defense and stuff like that. And um, just allow us to play basketball, man. We enjoy the game that you guys gave us. I'm not going to lie to you. I am enjoying it. I wish that I could play better defense. We have figured out how to play some team defense, but we just need to be able to play better individual defense. I think we'll be fine. Uh, shot contests need to be addressed and stuff like that. But I said that in another video, man. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ.
God speak. God speak.